Welcome to Epigenetic Reprogramming, Volume 4. In the first sessions, we had discussed certain nutraceuticals which can promote our cellular fount of youth. We had also discussed certain very valuable nutraceuticals which are effective in protecting us from oxidative stress and senescent cells, which are key major factors in premature aging. In this last session, we will emphasize two key vitamins, which have got also very important roles in preventing premature aging. One of these vitamins is vitamin C. There is a general perception that vitamin C is bioavailable, meaning that all of the vitamin C we consume is uptaken by blood. Unfortunately, this is not true. The bioavailability of vitamin C decreases with higher doses. So meaning if you're using conventional vitamin C, it will not make any sense to increase the amount of it. So it is proven that liposomal technology can increase the bioavailability of vitamin C significantly, but moreover, in the recent years, there have been several papers published showing that liposomal vitamin C is fivefold more taken by cells than conventional vitamin C. We can see from this published clinical paper that liposomal vitamin C has got approximately 1.7 times higher bioavailability than conventional one. We know that vitamin C has got very important physiological roles. One of it is it's a potent antioxidant, pretty much like glutathione, which protects us from oxidative stress, which might lead to premature aging. Vitamin C contributes to the protection of the cells. It has got essential functions in protecting the beauty of our skin. And also vitamin C contributes to normal collagen formation for the normal functioning of the skin. So meaning that vitamin C is also a key ingredient in protecting the premature aging of our skin. Another key vitamin, which is also important in protecting premature aging, is vitamin D3. As you all know already, vitamin D3 is by far distance one of the most important vitamins which we must remain in appropriate physiological levels. Vitamin D3 controls a lot of different biological functions within our body. And in the last years, we had investigated the effect of vitamin D3 in supporting longevity. From our first session, you will remember that our genetic material is wrapped and packed in structures which we call chromosomes. There is an interesting part at the end of the chromosome, which we call telomeres. And these telomeres define our true cellular age. Shorter telomeres are characteristics for older cells. Richards and colleagues had published a study which had shown that higher levels of vitamin D3 are related with longer telomeres, or with other words, with the younger cells. But why should we consume liposomal vitamin D3? Normally, our body can synthesize vitamin D3 from cholesterol by exposing to sunlight. But unfortunately, this mechanism is compromised when we are not exposed to enough amounts of sun, when we are old, when we have got overweight, 
or when we have got low levels of cholesterol, our body's vitamin D3 synthesis is compromised. In such case, we need to supply vitamin D3 with dietary supplements. But supplying vitamin D3 is quite a difficult issue because there might be not enough vitamin D3 in the food we consume. If our gallbladder is removed, we see that vitamin D3 absorption declines. If we have got low levels of magnesium, again, vitamin D3 bioavailability is compromised. Or if we are old, the absorption of vitamin D3 declines. So what could be the solution to overcome so many factors and provide the requisite amounts of vitamin D3? Thanks to liposomal technology, we witness an effective uptake of liposomes into the lymphatic brain. From there, it is delivered into the bloodstream, where it is delivered to the liver, and from the liver, it is synthesized to calcifediol, and from there, it is transported to the kidney, where it becomes its active form as calcitriol. So liposomal vitamin D3 is proven to increase the bioavailability and making it less dependent on other factors that might decline the bioavailability of vitamin D3. As a matter of fact, in, an, in clinical use of vitamin D3, we witness that the bioavailability had increased three times compared to non-liposomal vitamin D3. But again, it is not only important to increase the bioavailability of vitamin D3, it is also important that appropriate liposomes can deliver vitamin D3 effectively into the cell. Coming to the bottom line of the epi epigenetic reprogramming summer school. Global population is getting older. We mentioned that newborns in 2019 will be faces ages which are over 90 years. Health span is now a bigger concern than lifespan because most of the people want to remain in the healthy status even in their later days. The community is thriving for effectively longevity products and epigenetic reprogramming is one of the most important interventions regarding longevity and also preventing premature aging. Liposomal products are offering a broad selection of products that intervene on epigenetic reprogramming. The reason why we mentioned the importance of liposomal encapsulation of these valuable nutraceuticals is that first, liposomal technology can overcome the bioavailability problem of this individual ingredients, but moreover, they can carry the ingredient effectively into the cells where epigenetic reprogramming is happening. Thank you for listening to the Summer School of Epigenetic Reprogramming. I hope that you enjoyed this short sessions and I wish you a restful and healthy summer holiday and hope to meet you in next videos where we will discuss other liposomal products. Stay safe and healthy. Bye-bye.